Oh, deary me, what type of keynote speech was that? Megan was a keynote speaker at the One Young World Forum 2022 held at Manchester. I was really suffering while listening to her. It was vacuous, boring and way, way too long. It seems like it was going on forever, completely uninspiring. But then, what do you expect from narcissistic but otherwise someone with an empty coconut shell in her head? A shell that is full of echoes of herself. <sighs> like what Daily Mail reported, Megan said nothing. They were all together 48. I, I'm, me, myself, my life. You see, it's Megan being herself all over again. She can't help it, isn't it? Every opportunity she has, every platform she has, she will talk about herself. It is always about herself. I managed to get this steal from the video and I look at some of the expressions on the guests who were at the forum. Look at the board, even pain expressions during her speech. The only one who looked attentive, almost mesmerized, was Harry, her husband, her ever supportive, obedient husband. There were so many accomplished luminaries at the forum, including the former Irish head of state and climate justice advocate, President Mary Robinson, musician and activist Sir Bob Geldof, USA Olympian E.P.T. Hajj Mohammad, and oceanographer and author Professor Sylvia Earle. What are Megan's achievements compared to them? Of course, who could miss that red suit? Red is the colour of victory and defiance. Megan does not wear red for no reason. There is a reason I'm sure she chose her outfit very carefully for this occasion. The red suit is a signal to the UK, especially the royal family, that she is back as she has promised, walking tall and proud. By the way, please refer to my previous analysis of the white dress she wore at the Platinum Jubilee Thanksgiving by clicking the link below but only after this video. Megan is a sore thumb and an eyesore for the royal family and all her critics and detractors, but certainly indefatigable and irrepressible for the time being, very much the survivor up to now. This is certainly a victory parade for her. Harry, the trophy husband. Well, I'm coming to Harry now. Okay, he is her trophy husband. Remember? I, do, I did a, a short uh, video and I spoke about calling Harry the soon to be kicked to the curb prince. But wait, not so fast yet. Megan still needs him because of the title, the association with the royal family whom she is continually bashing. Poor Harry is still useful. He's useful for his contacts in UK. Now, I need to add that Megan has another use for Harry. And what is the use? He is her trophy husband, her achievement. She likes brandishing him around. If you had listened to her keynote speech, she mentioned she got married like no one knows, but then marrying a prince is her only achievement so far. You can't blame that woman, can you? I've reached the end of my video. I'm planning a lot of videos ahead. Please click the subscription and like buttons, not forgetting the notification button as well. In the meantime, stay safe and well. Bye for now.